Good morning, YouTube. Freddie Cardona here. And on this episode of Pride and Patterson, we're going to take you on Trenton Avenue. Let me zoom in here so you can see that. Trenton Avenue and Lakeview Avenue here in the Lakeview section of Patterson, New Jersey. I've been getting a lot of requests to do uh, another driving series episode and uh, specific requests for Lakeview Avenue, Trenton Avenue, Lakeview Avenue, things like that. So come on with me and enjoy the trip. All right, so here we are on Crooks Avenue. We're going north on Trenton Avenue. And to the left here, you have the Howard Condominiums. This area here is called the Lakeview section. It borders Clifton uh, over here on Crooks Avenue. And I wanted to take a moment to thank all of you that watch my videos. I think I have right now, as we speak, 354 subscribers. So you guys are awesome. I never expected that. Um, I know primarily a lot of my subscribers are coming from the Pride and Patterson playlist. So I appreciate you all uh, coming on this channel and checking out my videos as we cross Buffalo Avenue. And let me just stop here for a moment, let this car go past, because I don't want to go too fast. I want to uh, drive slowly so that um, if you guys wanted to stop the, and pause the video and kind of take a look around. For any of you who are from the Lakeview section, and like I said earlier in the video, I got a lot of comments uh, from folks who are from the Lakeview section and wanted to see uh, Trenton Avenue and Lakeview Avenue. So going back to my channel, I, I really, really appreciate you all taking the time uh, to, to view the videos here. And here we are in the back part of School 25 to my right and some assorted small stores to the left. We have a deli, beauty salon, we have a Caribbean station, primarily Spanish food. So yeah, I've been putting up Pride and Patterson videos, I think now for about three years. And I, I again, I cannot thank you guys enough. It really means a lot to me when you guys comment um, and you tell me that you enjoy the videos. And, and it really makes me want to continue making more. And we have a Jehovah's Witness uh, church here on the right and some more apartments here on the right now we're going to cross over route 80 and to the right would have been the Alabama projects and the, we used to call that and, and most of the folks that lived at the projects there used to call that the pound at the fire station here to the right side engine company number three and those guys do an amazing job here in the city of Patterson and we're coming up on 22nd Avenue. We have a, I, I can't let this video go by without talking about um, our current administration here in Patterson. Uh, currently we have the mayor, Andre Sayeg, and we have uh, some council women and councilmen, Melissa Mims, Luis Velez, and a couple of others I can't think of right now, but I just wanted to speak on what I've seen so far. Now, again, this is just my opinion, and um, I don't really hold to that whole Democrat liberal thing. It's just whoever's in office and is doing the best job for the city. That's what concerns me. Uh, it doesn't matter to me if you're lib if you're liberal or conservative, as long as you're doing a good job. And it looks like this administration is doing a really, really good job. Um, they seem to be cohesive. They seem to be united for the good of Patterson. And I really see a lot of good things coming up for, for Patterson. And I had occasion to meet uh, Dr. Lelissa Mims, councilwoman at large. And you could just tell, speaking to her, how passionate she is about Patterson. And how she always puts the issues in, in priority the things that are happening in Patterson we recently had a flood and we had some areas that are flooded and her and the other council person council people is that how I can say it they were all out there I got to tell you I'm very very impressed by what I've seen so far in the mayor and they're all out there trying to uh, 
address the issues with the flooding in a more, in a timely manner. So that's really 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 encouraging. So we made a right hand turn here because we're going to go. I want to show you Lakeview Avenue. Now I don't know if I can make a right turn on red here. I don't see any signs, but I'm going to wait. Don't want to break the law. I don't know if you see that over here. You see the McDonald's right here on Market Street. That's a dangerous store to have so close to these houses because we go in there and have some delicious McDonald's food if that's what you're into. I'm kind of, I kind of like the Big Mac from Burger King and the Wendy's hamburger. Those are good. Every now and then though, I will go into Mickey D's, which is what we call it here in P-Town, Mickey D's. this area here we're headed to Lakeview Avenue and you have a lot of uh, single-family homes here and you're gonna have the cemetery to your left and this used to be on the right used to be a furniture store for those of you that remember it's now a, uh, a supermarket we're going back over route 80 so to my left you will have the entrance to route 80 and we have a guy here who decides to just get right in the middle. That's okay. It's all good. We can all share the road. So on the left you have the cemetery. And to the right you have primarily one family homes. And the speed limit here is 25. So I recommend anyone who's going to travel this particular road to please stay at 25. So that you won't get summoned safety is super important remember the faster you're driving when you do get into a collision the more damage there will be to your vehicle and to you so remember that when you're driving either on these roads or on the highways keep your speed to the speed limit so that no one gets hurt everyone gets home to their family and as we come up here to the end of Lakeview Avenue this will end this episode 33 of Pride and Patterson. Again, guys, I want to thank you for sticking with me for all these years. I really, really appreciate it. If you're interested in being notified of any future videos, please subscribe to the channel so you can um, be notified. And I wanted to reiterate what I do in all my videos. I do not monetize these videos. I make mon I make no money off of these videos. My my only hope is that we can lift Patterson up from its bad reputation, its unfair reputation, and by making these videos, um, it, it I feel hopefully it will help when people do do searches on YouTube and they put in Patterson they may not they they won't see some fight on main street you know and things that don't happen all the time you know you figure I there was one big fight on main street a few years ago and you haven't heard of one since but when someone types in Patterson New Jersey that video is the very first one you see so for people who are not from Patterson who don't live in Patterson and who have never been to Patterson they see that video and they think wow there's a fight on Main Street every day but that's just not the case it really isn't Patterson's a great town it, it gets a bad reputation um, I think a lot of it has to do with um, the image that's portrayed of us here in Patterson um, I feel it's unfair uh, for anyone who, who lives in Patterson or who works in Patterson um, they'll agree that it, it's not it's not what people think I hear a lot of I hear a lot of folks saying that Patterson is is gone down the tubes it's uh, I don't like to use bad language on my channel but I hear that I hear people say that it's a blank hole <laughs> and I'll be that's that I say blank hole instead of going beep hole <laughs> so yeah thank you again guys and um, just to let you know too, I also have other videos, um, it's, a, it's called an adventure series basically where I may go on a trip somewhere or 
let's say my most recent trip to Wildwood, New Jersey this year. I'll probably post a video on that in the future. Um, maybe go to New York City, a trip to New York City, Bear Mountain, New Jersey. Just places that I go to, I'll probably post those videos. So thanks again, guys, and we'll see you on the next video.